seen a, a, a couple of your interviews before. Mm-hmm. Is that, that it's like like a little family. Like Yo. y'all cool. That hey, hey, I know you. You I know you. You know me. Hey, we all in this thing together. Let's make it work. Yeah, it take a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> it take a lot of money to build that village, boy. It take you know. I realized it, that that's what it took. It was a certain amount of money to finally get them baby mamas. Right. They'd be like, all right. So it was a certain amount of money that I had to really, okay, let me make sure you straight for real, not right. just a kid. You got a house, you got a car, you got a house, you got a car, and put everybody on the same level, kind of. And they all just, hey, man, they So there wasn't a competition because sometimes, okay, if she gets $5, $100 mm-hmm. more, well, I got to go back because I can't let her get more than me. Yeah. And I can't let her have more than me. You gave her a car, I need a car. If she help, you helping her with her rent and mortgage, you need to help me too. Yep. So you taking all that out of it. Taking all that out. You got this. She got this, she got this, she got this, everybody equal, let's be happy. Let's get it. Yep. So when you had the kids two weeks apart, so how you go back up there and the nurses see you? They just saw you two weeks ago in here with a baby. Yeah, they they judged me with their eyes. Because you know, I gotta look through the glass again. They just see me. <laughs> but I'm, I'm I'm trying to block my face. They're like, you was here? I like, yeah, don't judge me, please. You left something, yeah, another baby. <laughs> so you know, it was a small town, everybody right. knew so. Yeah. Right. So, the majority of the women are from Millen and Statesboro. Yeah, Millen and State, Millen and Statesboro. Um, my last mother with kids. She from Kansas City. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, yep. So, yep. Millen and Statesboro. You done with kids? Oh yeah, I'm done now. Yeah. I, Cause I thought you know, <clears throat> you have a dance off, you have a sing off. People are thinking you and Nick Cannon was having a kid off. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, can, see, the Candyman store, he had a lot of kids after the money. Right. So I, I had some in the street, so right. I got away some years right. with the, you know, the regular life. Right. But yeah, I had a lot of kids. I had seven kids by the time I was 22. So, you seven know, by 22? Yeah. So three of them, um, three of them came, you know, I'm 36 now, so between 22 and 36, last 14 years, I had three kids. Right. Mm-hmm. Well, you should, I mean, so let me, I mean, did you lay down at night like, man, I'm 17 year old, I got a kid. Damn, I'm 18, I got another one. Yeah. I'm 19, got another one. Like, damn. Yeah. I, I went to the Army the first one. I went to basic training, uh, but I ain't go back to AIT, but I had went, um, I went to basic training. The, what do you thought basic training was going to do? No, I had, I had to go. Uh, oh, you had to go find I had work. to go find a job yeah. immediately. So, you know, going to 12th grade, I went to basic training uh, on, on the way to 12th grade. That right. summer, they let you go to. Um, um, basic training, but okay. yeah, I was just like, man, when I first when I had my first son, I was like, all right, and then me, me, uh, the mother, um, the mother, of my kids, their mother, my first kid's mother, me and her graduated together, and my last name Coley, her last name Cooper, so we sit beside each other, and I looked at her, I said, have your peer 